What's up guys and welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm actually gonna be talking about how to make $100 per day trading either Bitcoin or altcoins. The previous video that I made on this topic actually got over 1.1 million views. So I thought it's been a few years, it's time to refresh and update that video with some new practices and also some better techniques. There are so many more altcoins out there right now in the market and I think there is much better ways that we can actually be going out there and making profit from trading them. So in today's video, I'm gonna be going through some techniques Techniques on how you can find these coins to trade um, over on CoinMarketCap and other websites, how you can in fact trade them um, using platforms like Binance, Bybit, Femex, and also how you can chart them as well on TradingView. I'm gonna be telling you all that information completely for free. All I ask from you in today's video is simply drop a like and that will be absolutely amazing. So guys, without any further ado, let's jump into the charts, let's jump into the computer and get on with today's video. All right, guys, so now we are in the computer. If you haven't already, definitely subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be posting so many more tutorials like this and also almost daily Bitcoin and altcoin analysis. So definitely subscribe. You don't want to miss out on these future videos. So right now we are on a website called CoinMarketCap. If you don't know what this is, this basically aggregates all the different cryptocurrencies out there and it lets you see price action, movements, information about them and everything like that. So CoinMarketCap is pretty much where I start my day. Always I log on to CoinMarketCap in the morning and check the prices, check my portfolio as well. You can track your portfolio on here. Uh, and overall, just have a look at the general health of the market. One of the great things about CoinMarketCap though is you can search by 24 hours or you can filter uh, and sort by 24 hours and seven days. For example, here we can see uh, CeeLo has gained 24%. That's the highest gainer today in the last 24 hours. And we can also check on seven days as well. Um, the highest gainer here again is CeeLo. We have Dai and Quant as well. Um, yeah, basically that's what we can do there. Also, we can select uh, the, the losers here for down 41%, down 35% on seven days and on 24 hours, down 7%, down 6.5% uh, as well. This is where it starts to get very interesting. And this is usually how I go about finding the coins which I want to trade. One of the things, if we can select a coin on the seven day chart, which is actually down uh, by quite a lot, this could potentially reveal a buying opportunity. Right here, we can see uh, Kusama, AMP, Internet Computer, Near Protocol, Phantom, um, Ravain, Horizon, Neo, Polkadot as well. And some of these coins are even really good, like Polkadot is ranked number nine. We have Neo, uh, we have AMP here, we have Kusama. All these coins are great coins. To, uh, Ontology, Nexo, Ave, Thorchain, all these coins are great, great coins. It's not like we're, we're trying to trade uh, shit coins or anything like that. These are all uh, coins with a huge market cap, which you can see right here. Also, we want to check out the volume as well. Volume, I, I like to have a decent amount of volume, at least around 50 million or, or 30 to 50 million at least. Here we can see we have 180 million, 45 million, um, right here, 165 million. All of these have plenty, uh, plenty, plenty of volume. Here we have around um, just below 4 million, which definitely is on the lower side of things. Probably I wouldn't want to go ahead and trade something like that. Depends really on how much you're trading with. You can get in and out on trades, but if the volume is lower, it's going to be more difficult if you make a lot of profit to, in fact, get out of that trade. So that's the first thing you want to do. You want to go to CoinMarketCap and identify the um, old coin which you want to trade. Also, there's another website which makes it a little bit more fun. It's called uh, CryptoBubbles.net. Uh, and you can go over here and select, for example, the hour. You can select the day. Uh, and right here, it makes it a little bit more fun. fun. For example, if we click on link right here, we can see the chart overall here trending downwards. We can see the volume, the rank, and everything like that. So it's a really interesting chart to see here on the day. Also the week we can see as well, for example, if things are down in the week. Now in the markets, as of filming this, we've had a fairly rough week. We can see many things down 20 and more uh, percent. For example, um, Theta down 25%, Link down 15%, uh, KSM down 42%. So we can see a lot of opportunities here in the market. If we go on the month, we had a, f a few different green ones, but nothing really too crazy. And on the year, most likely we're going to be all green. Yeah, we can see we've had a huge year. Look at Doge here right here, 10.5 uh, thousand percent up, which is absolutely crazy. So then what we want to do is go ahead and find ourselves a coin to trade. One thing I did want to point out though, guys, before we get any further in today's video, if you want more knowledge about how to trade, if you want more advice, more strategies, more techniques, if you want the support that you need to in fact go ahead and make profitable trades, link down below, I have my Bitcoin blueprint. And this is pretty much your A to Z guide on how to make money with cryptocurrency, how to trade for long term and a day trade, swing trade, how to invest for the long term as well in cryptocurrency. In here, we 
we've had already thousands of students and successful students as well and I would really um, welcome you to go ahead and check out the link down below in today's video and you can even book a free strategy and assessment call with Ben our student success manager or Matty as well um, and you can go ahead and talk about the blueprint for 20 minutes on a completely free call all that will be linked down below also guys all the exchanges featured in today's video we have Binance we have Femex as well where I have a trade open in around 66,000 US dollars in profit and we have Bybit as well all of these different platforms have bonuses for example Bybit right now around $1,600 Femex is around $200 bonus uh, Binance as well that will be updated and linked down below all of these exchanges have bonuses and in order to get those bonuses all you have to do is join using my link down there I get a bonus you get a bonus everyone's happy and hopefully we can make some profitable trades so for example what you want to do is go over to call my call market cap here and sort by seven days right here we have uh, Kusama right here and if you want to click on that like that uh, you want to see which exchange it's hosted on for example go down here and click market and then when that loads you can see okay the most uh, the highest volume here is on Binance and it's in a USDT pairing so then what you would want to do is you want to simply um, go over to Binance you'd want to go over and make yourself an account if you haven't already with the link down below click advanced like so this will bring up the um, the exchange if you haven't already watched my tutorial on Binance Femex or Bybit all those will be linked down below as well and available on my channel completely free we then click up here and we want to find the uh, identifier for um, Kusama which is KSM so then we simply type in up here KSM then KSM USDT that's the pairing we want and we can see here it's had a fairly um, we see lower highs right here we see lower lows as well so it's looking fairly bearish however when we pull up the charts in just a minute we could see or we might be able to see if there is an actual buying opportunity here so next we want to go over to trading view right now I've got the Bitcoin price open as of filming this the price is thirty three thousand dollars however we want we want to focus on the uh, asset of choice right here which is KSM what you want to do is if you haven't already got yourself a trading view account as well you can go ahead and get one I believe I do have a link down below uh, as well if you want to help out the channel but you can use it for free or if you wanted to use more indicators then you can go ahead and get yourself a pro account then we type in here KSM USDT like so KSM USDT and it's on the Binance exchange let's click that and take a look at the chart then the first thing that we're going to do once we open this chart is go to the four hour chart as that gives us a lot of information on a easy to manage time frame now this is where the interesting part comes in if you want to make hundred dollars per day you have to be in and out of a trade within the time frame of one day of course it's hundred dollars per day so the best way to do that I find is by using two different indicators the first one is the Bollinger Bands click on indicators and just simply type in BB click Bulger bands like so and then close it this will bring up the Bulger bands now maybe it's a little bit hard for you to see on the screen right now and um, so maybe I can edit this to make it a little bit more um, easy to see like so like so I'll just make this the lines a little bit thicker so it's easier to see maybe I make them a little bit brighter as well so it's uh, easier to in fact see if you're watching at home so first of all we have the Bollinger Bands that has now been brought up on screen and basically what these do it's a, it's a moving average and the price trades between them and this yellow line in the middle here is a medium and usually what people say is the price bounces from the lower to the higher and vice versa from the higher to the lower band and this is where a great trading opportunity can uh, prevail itself however we don't want to use just one indicator we want to also bring up the RSI again click on indicators type in RSI relative strength index and that will bring this up usually the values on this um, are between around 70 up here and 30 down here this is what they are preset to I'm going to change uh, the RSI colors just so you can see them a lot easier at home uh, like so okay now basically the 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 way that we can go ahead and trade something like this or look for potential trade opportunities is when the RSI is in fact below 30 so we are oversold which is down here below this white dotted line here and when the bullet the price the price uh, candlesticks are touching the lower level of the Bollinger Band let's see for example um, examples in the past we have right here first of all a the price is touching the lower level of the Bollinger Band B the RSI is outside of this lower level of 30 so it's oversold this would indicate a great time to buy and we can see from looking back in history if we would have bought on this time 
maybe we couldn't get an exact entry point down there and we were sold when we hit the top Bulger band, we would have a profit of around 72% in just one day, four hours. Now, yes, this is a completely um, extraordinary example. It's not gonna happen like this. Usually you'd be looking for around two to 5% profit, um, maybe a little bit more if you wanted to be a bit more greedy uh, per day to make. Of course, not every day you're going to make this. Some days you may make 20%, some days you may lose three or 4%, but overall on an average that can turn out to $100 per day if you are trading with enough capital. Again, let's look again. Right here, we touched the lower level of the Bollinger Band. However, um, we weren't here on the RSI, so I wouldn't have entered that point. Of course, you could have entered and made a profit selling on the upper level of the Bollinger Band. So we could have entered right here, sold right here. However, that's only using one indicator. Of course, you can still do it. It's still profitable. However, um, using two indicators, it's a lot safer. Let's take a look at another example. Uh, we can see right here. This is a good example. Um, right here on the four hourly chart, we touched the lower level of the Bollinger Band right here. Um, and we and also we were outside. So we can see right there and also right there. This is an example, a, a more realistic example. And we can see we came up here and we touched the median. Also, you can sell when you touch the median as well. You don't have to wait until the upper level of the Bollinger Band because when they are stretched, spread quite far apart like so, it's gonna be a little bit more difficult for them to actually go ahead and do that. So you can either take 50%, 100% profit when you hit the median, or you can take 50% and wait until we get to the other side. In this example, we would have seen around about a 15% uh, profit, which is definitely something really, really nice, just in the space of around eight hours. So it's definitely within a day time frame. So now let's talk, take a look at an example um, in the current live market price. Right here, we can see we touched the, the lower level of the Bollinger Band. And again, right here, we in fact touched the 30 RSI, which was signal it's a great time to go ahead and enter. If we would have entered, um, we would currently be up around 8% in the space of around 16 hours. So this is just an, another way which we can actually go ahead and make some nice profits while day trading. If you wanted to take a look more on, on the swing trading side of things, which means a trade, um, kind of in a longer term, you can also do this on a longer term profile as well. For example, touching the lower level of the Bollinger Band here um, and almost out uh, or out, which we can say right here. However, this um, coin on the on the longer scale is going completely crazy since it's had such a, a large pump up recently. Uh, it is dumping quite a bit. So I'd recommend doing it on something a little more stable, but definitely for short term trades, it's definitely interesting. So um, yeah, that's basically that on the daily chart. However, back to the four hourly chart, Chart. The ways that we can go ahead and make these $100 is simply by finding these different coins on CoinMarketCap, going ahead and executing small trades, um, aiming to be in and out within, within the day. This is definitely a viable method which we can go ahead and do. All right, guys, thanks for watching today's video. I really do appreciate it. If you did get some value from it, definitely drop a like on today's video. And also don't forget to check out the Bitcoin Blueprint, which is linked down below, the A to Z guide on how you can make money and grow your wealth with cryptocurrency. Also, don't forget to check out the exchanges. I've got Femex here, which currently I'm up 66,000 US dollars in my trade, and also Bybit as well, where you can get over $1,600 in bonuses. Thanks for watching today's video, guys, and I'll catch you in the next one.